Dividing that by four, we get negative one third and then x plus two. Okay, that's just gonna help me to, so we can see a nice clear p-value. Again, it's y squared and it's a negative p-value, so that means we're opening this way. Okay, now let's get all the critical points. So first, let's get the vertex, let's get the focus, and now since my p-value is negative one-third, and I know it's opening to the left, I'm going to take that negative one-third, add it to this x-value, and we get negative two and one-third, or negative seven-thirds, comma two, and then my direct we'd be going the other direction. So we're gonna add one third to that, which would be negative one and two thirds. So it's X equals negative five thirds. So our vertex is at negative two, two. Our directrix is right behind it. And then our focus is one third to the left, little focus there. And then we kind of wrap it around like this, wrap it around like this. There's your graph. That's how you do it. Done.